Uh, as many of you know, um, I'm originally from Liberia, and I've had the honor to live in several host countries. Nothing teaches you more about tolerance than being a guest um, in someone else's country. Wait in the water, wait in the water, children, wait in the water. God's going to carry you through the waters. 1976 to 1994, you cried openly out loud with your whole heart. Your fountain of strength, bittersweet tears, that strength that you used to fight demons and fears. Every victory earned with the lives and dignity of your people overshadowed failure. Every setback on a backdrop of black blood into a burning flame, metamorphosized, pushing the cause, fueled by gusts of injustice and fanned by hatred, the flame never died. 1994 to 2000. Cry no more, you are beautiful. Wounds healing, head lifted high, dead demons provide the strut in your stride. Your vibrant light blinds them, opens their eyes, and makes them see that for years you cried freedom, but now you're finally free. 2000 to 2015. But that freedom came at a price. It gave root to arrogance, entitlement, and overcompensation, squeezing the rainbow right out of the nation, excusing ANC for life justifications. We have tolerated, but we cannot tolerate. Amakwere Kwere is what you called us. Although the whole continent fought on your side, we are now different, burned alive in car tires for promoting African pride, xenophobic weapons and rants, separation versus inclusion, African unity, a distant illusion. Wait in the water, wait in the water, children, wait. In the water, God's going to carry you through the waters. Oceans away, in one of my second host countries, a confused artist in Washington, D.C. grows up wanting to be black in the land of the free. Rachel DeLizo, you may have heard her name. Can you blame her? Who wouldn't want to be black? After all, hashtag Black Lives Matter and being black is mad cool, hashtag black girls rock. But her secret got out that she had passed as black. Her life, a media spectacle, global groundbreaking news, her crime, her shame, her cross to bear. Yet, we don't scream cultural misappropriation when we bleach our skins and straighten our hair. We have tolerated, let's learn to tolerate. Wait in the water. Wait in the water, children, wait in the water. God's going to carry you through the water.